What's up everyone? Today's the day. I let you guys know last in the last video when I was watching the Datsun that I'm picking up a new car and we're going to get, pick it up today. Alan's on his way to pick me up and we're heading over there. Uh, we got to head out of town about an hour drive because they had no cars here in town, but I think he's pulling up right now. Let's go see this ugly lost troll. There he is boys, there he is. The lost man himself making an appearance after a year. Up, boy. Well, we're on our way to the dealership. Just wanted to give you guys a little backstory on why I'm getting this car. So, RCF's fully fixed up. All I got left is the hood, and that should be arriving in about a month or two. He's working on making it. But that car's ready for show, and I'm not trying to drive it around every day, especially since it's bagged. Streets in Bakersfield are horrible. Dotson's not ready for daily driving yet. I still gotta get the transmission fixed, gotta get the engine tuned up, get it fully working in good condition. Um, then I'll start driving that one around until I start fixing it. And then my other daily is being used by my wife. So I started looking into trucks, really wanted to get a truck. That's always been like my thing as in my daily, but it's just not the right market for trucks. They were trying to make me overpay 15, 20 grand for the truck. So I said, I'll wait off on that. Started looking into other cheaper cars, but trying to keep it sporty, keep it nice and new. And me and Alan were talking, going back and forth on different cars. And we landed on one car that's always been kind of something I wanted. I was even looking at it back in high school and now they got a newer, cleaner version of it. Easy to modify if I ever decide to later on, but at the moment we'll keep a stop. Try and just wheels, yeah, for now. Maybe some wheels in a couple months, maybe some like eBay spoiler or something, but for now we'll keep a stop. Honestly, in my opinion, I think the car Bond's gonna get is one of the better cars on the market right now for the price. And personally, I wouldn't mind one, but I think I'd rather have the old generation just because of the way it looks. O older gen of this car is, there's there's been a lot done to those that generation. Like, everybody's done anything possible to that car. Yeah, that so, kind of give you a hint, that car has been out for 10 years in that generation, that form. Now there's a newer model. Comment down below if you're kind of getting what it is. Put that down below right now before we reveal it but we will reveal it towards the end of this video. I have a mutual customer here in our dealership in the process of purchasing a new vehicle. Should we do all the paperwork because it has been a little bit since you've last signed? Mm -hmm. like Congratulations. Ridiculous. Thank you, appreciate it, man. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, we're in the car. Hopefully there's no logos behind us, but you can look around the interior and guess what car this is already. But I'll finally show you guys. Picked up the new GR86. Got it in pearl white, or they I think they call it halo on this car. I don't know why, but you got the brand new GR86. This is the car that I wanted even back in high school as my first car. I ended up getting a, what was it, 528? A BMW 528? Yeah. But yeah, I was trying to get a Subaru BRZ, the limited edition in that nice blue color. Uh, Pops didn't want me to, so I didn't. But I got the upgraded one, the GR86. We're about to take it out for a run. Gotta get up. Oh, we got an automatic. No. Yeah, I, can't, I can't be driving a manual while I'm trying to catch Pokemon. text or play some Pokemon Go or something, man. Shit. Hey, yo. Hey. Hey, yo. It's a party over here. That was automatic. Could have had a Tundra. We got some Tundra. Could have had a Tundra. But nah, they don't want to customize them with the upgraded screen. All right, time to get some rips. Sounds nice. For thirty-five thousand dollar car, GR86. That's actually really nice. All right, we gotta get the peel. Everything's fresh, except the eleven miles. Well, now it's twelve miles that they put on my car. Oh shit! There's a cop right there, and we're filming. Just finished the test drive. Told them we're all good to go. Everything's good. Signed off on the car. Now look at this baby. Brand new, right off the boat. They pre-sold this thing. Look at Alan lounging the AC already. Lazy ass. They pre-sold this car to me before it even arrived, right when they found out it was getting allocated here, but this thing is beautiful. I don't know how long I'm gonna be able to keep it stock, but I'm gonna try my best to keep it stock as long as I can. This is gonna be my new daily for at least a year or two till I can afford to buy a truck and the market goes down, but one day I'm gonna have that truck right there. So this is it, the newest addition to the Visionary Motors family. 
But this one's gonna stay stock. Keep it stock as long as I can, like I said, but. Like a month. Month, two months, maybe. That's as long as I can, we'll see. Maybe throw some wheels on it, get a street hunter duck bill or something, but wide body and all that stuff not happening until I can replace it with a different daily. So for now, this is it. Beautiful car. We just took it around, drove it around, tested out the sport mode on it. Works pretty good. Thanks everyone for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Check out our older videos. Check out the Datsun I just showed in the last video. That's getting built right after SEMA. Uh, make sure to hit the bell notification. Check out all of our videos. Get notified whenever I post. I have been posting a little bit more. I'm trying to post as much as I can, but Thanks everyone who's been here since the start.